What's up guys, I'm Vion and I own the channel for Echo XL's kennel. You can follow the kennel page on Instagram. I'm gonna drop the link down in the description below. Today I'm just taking you on a walk through the woods with the dogs and then we're gonna go back to the, we're gonna go back to our yard in a little bit so I can show you how I exercise them there and how I exercise them in the woods. Echo, leave her alone. I like to make it a part of my day to exercise with my dogs because I know it's good for them and it's also good for me to walk around with them and run with them. Right now I'm not running because I just don't feel like it and they're way too fast for me. I'm not gonna be able to catch up today. My legs are sore. It is good for the dogs though. I see a lot of overweight dogs and honestly it's kind of sad because you should take out a good 10 to 15 minutes of your day at least just to walk with your dog or walk your dog. I happen to be very lucky to live a little walk away from this woods right here. So I like to just take my dogs out here and walk with them. They normally do follow me. The little one kind of final follows Lily around and Lily kind of just follows where I go. So it works out. I have one problem with walking through the woods. Not that I don't like doing it because I love being out here with the dogs. I just have a very snappy dog. That is her running up right now. Hello, Lily. That's my baby right there, but she is a snappy snappy dog she's overly protective and when she sees someone she i don't yo the, she's like bipolar or something because one day she'll go for them the next day she won't go for them so like i never know who she's gonna go after or who she's not who she's gonna act friendly towards who she's not nope you can keep going lily leave him alone And I don't like to keep them leashed up when I'm walking through the woods because it's time for them to run free, for them to get their exercise in, and just like, I love watching them run around with each other. But it can be challenging if someone's back here and Lily's off leash, because again, she's just a snappy dog. I do, ow, ow, ow. However, I do carry her leash just in case I do see someone. Before she does, I will call her back and she obeys and she'll get herself on the leash. Girl, what are you doing? You just went through the hardest way to get over that. All right, we are walking back now from the woods. We finished our walk. I'm gonna attempt to get the ball back from Lily because she kind of took it and ran with it. I took it out here for like bribery to get them to like run towards the camera. So I, this will be part of the bloopers. So I'll show you guys how I make these videos. Oh, she dropped the ball and I got it. <laughs> Come on, baby. Not set up for the tennis ball shots. Oh god. Another way my dogs get their exercise in is through this a tennis ball. Basic stuff, it's a dollar, it works, they run for it. That's that's all I gotta say about the tennis ball. It works. It's a ball, it's a dog and a ball.
Kaj ti ba? Kaj? Mm-hmm.